Forest, Tim. Um, I did my outreach in Mozambique in a town called Pemba. Um, and while I was there, we did this ministry called Bush Bush. Go out to villages that have never heard about Jesus before. So we went into the village, and the first lady we came to was this older lady, and so we prayed for her, and her eye turns white, or from white to brown. And she was able to see, and she like, was kind of like, whoa, what's going on? But because of the culture there, they have to remain stoic, otherwise they pay more money to witch doctors. And so she was trying to remain calm or whatever, and then I start freaking out because I'm like, what? No way! Like, this is wild! I just turned back to brown and she can see, like... So then she gets excited and takes us to her friend's house, and um, her friend had a boat out leg. Her ankle was, like, turned 90 degrees where it had been broken and hadn't healed right. And so we had prayed, and she was like, I don't believe in your God. I might have tried all these different things, and it's never worked. And we're like, our God is the healer, and he can heal you completely. Like, just let us pray. Just try it. And so she's like, fine, whatever. So we pray for her, and her, we watch her ankle go shh and pop back in. And she didn't need her crutch anymore. She didn't need people to help her. She was like running, like walking around, so stoked. And I'm like, no way! Like, this is so awesome. And so she takes us to this town, and she's like got all her friends around a fire, and they're like making bread and whatever. And then she brings back her husband. He's a witch doctor. And so he's like, I've never seen anything like this. And there's like just the peace of the Lord. And he's like, had no idea what was going on. And so I preach him the gospel and he's never heard anything like that before. And so he gave his life to the Lord. He cut off all of his witchcraft strings. The lady got off hers. And they actually like have a church in that village now.